What's going on, everybody? This is your boy, the RC Koga. This is Pierce in Season 1, Episode 9. I think the river. Something like that. So, while Jessica trying to get her cousin out of the street, because, you know, she lives in the tent now, because she was staying with Jessica last week, but she left. Her, her mom left, and she did meet up with her cousin. Um, I think that's her aunt, or her... I'm going to say that's her aunt. She met up with her and trying to get, um, trying to get Erica to, you know, get them a place where they don't have to stay in that tent. Because I know those kids have to be uncomfortable out there. Her two sons. But those are her, her neighbors that was fighting to get a, to get a home. Maybe they got put out of the apartment because the construction worker. They ducked out their apartment. And her and Jessica was going at it a little bit, but she really trying to help her. And then she almost lost her job right there. She was lucky. She had to be careful. Because her, I think that was her manager or her boss. And as the these take those food, these steal those food. And she said it wasn't really stealing, but it was still against the law. And she needed food, she could have talked to her about it. She would help her. And she understand what she's going through. But she had to do her job. She said she's going to be writing her up. She do this one more time. She writing her up. And she keep doing it, she's going to get fired. So I hope she be careful because I'm sure that's the only job she got. And I know she's working her ass off trying to... Because you can tell they're struggling <clears throat> to get in the home. Get a new home. Yeah, we know we got we got to see Bobby going at it with this dude. Just you know and then him and the him and Jessica were going at it. You could tell he was in his feeling. Then he took it out on this woman and you could tell he's upset with himself and he took it out on her. But later on he did apologize to her the way he acted that he should have handled it better. She forgave him, though, because she understand why he upset himself. And she brought him some boss and girls to thank him for saving his mother, her mother's life. Because he the one that did this for her, not Jessica. She was just helping. She only did her little part. <clears throat> and we know, we did see Bobby and his wife, Stephanie. And Stephanie knew about an affair. Remember last week she did talk to um Carrie about the affair and pretty much um Bobby trying to change the subject and, and always using the sick doctor excuse and that's not what she want to hear. She want she want him to tell the truth. Do you love me or do you love her? Because pretty much he gonna have to pick. And after that. He also was talking to Carrie and told him that you you avoid me, are you? And she said yes. You can know she want to end this, and she's trying to get her mind off of it. She really want to move on. That's why she's trying to quit this job. Bobby don't want her to go, but she did say you love me, you'll let me go because deep down inside she knows she she know that he loved he loved her. I know she loved him too. But she don't want to get crazy. Like, everybody already know about an affair. Jessica knew about this a long time ago with him and her, when her and Harvey went to Chicago. That's when she was still on the phone. You know, she don't work there no more. So, yeah. Yeah, he don't have to let her go. And then we see Nick, because Jessica had been asking about Nick and... Paris, or whatever his name is, he doesn't know yet. So when he showed up, he was there waiting for him. And he was going to put a bullet in him and himself. And when he went to uh, Carrie's house, he said that he needed help. He was going to talk to Bobby, but Bobby wasn't there. But she, he asked her that I need help. And she said she ain't the right person to talk to. Whatever she said, but he said he wanted to convict a, a murder. 
He wanted to turn himself in. That's why he asked her. And he knows he's in trouble. You could tell he's emotional. I don't think he mean to kill that guy. That's why he's emotional. And Jessica was looking for him too. And it just went crazy with him and um with her and Bobby. But things this got left. But yeah. Spat on her part because she did kiss him on the cheek. That was a pack on the cheek. You could tell they like each other. Do y'all think they're going to hook up? I think that'd be interesting. I guess we'll find out. We'll see what happened next week. But, yeah. That's when they ended, though, when Nick confessed a mother. I guess that's all I have to say. Because we already know that Elka is still fighting to get a home for her neighbor. It was her idea to do this. Remember when she remember when her mother told Jessica and Jessica and Jessica did her a favor, even she didn't ask for her help. She said that guy was using you. Cause he looked like he was using her. I feel like he was playing her. Look what happened to that other chick. She was played. That wasn't a little warrior. She, he was a phony. But guys, that's all I have to say about Pearson. Make sure you wait, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll see y'all in the next video. For my life is mother. Peace.